name is Dustin Cerny, Product Development Manager at FastTest. Today, I'm going to demonstrate our latest innovation, Connection Verification. A high-resolution sensor has been embedded into FE and FI quick connectors that provide an output signal when they have properly actuated. A proper actuation is reliant on the consistency of four key attributes. Pilot pressure, connector placement, the product dimensions, and the connector's main seal. Connection verification will alert operators if any of these four attributes fall out of spec, allowing operators to check the system prior to running a leak test, which will significantly reduce waste associated with the number one pain point in leak testing, the connection. When a leak test system has a bad connection without connection verification, the product fails a test and operators will have to rerun tests and spend time diagnosing why it failed. In automotive engine testing, a leak-free engine will be sent to a secondary inspection station and retested only to find out it was a connection failure at the original station. When multiple connectors are present, that diagnostic waste becomes even more significant. Here we have a connection verification quick connector and a calibration tool for easy programming or systems that don't include a PLC. These products have been assembled into a simple demonstration unit. The embedded sensor measures travel of the piston component down to a very fine resolution, approximately five thousandths of an inch. As I apply pressure to the FI connector, the piston moves forward and enters a pre-calibrated range that signals a good connection. As you can see, the LED lights up. As more pressure is applied, the piston travels beyond the good range and the LED goes off, signaling an over-travel condition. Over-travel can indicate part presence, an out-of-spec product, or even a short connect operator issue. To highlight the fine resolution of the sensor, a sample piece has been machined with a, only a 30 thousandths difference on each end. First, I will place the smaller end onto the FI connector, and no matter how much pressure I apply, I cannot get the LED to light up. If I deactuate the connector, put on the larger end, and actuate the connector, we get a good response signaled by the LED lighting up. Users are able to set a number of different calibration ranges depending on the application. Whether you want to trigger a leak test to start, identify part presence, or even sense when a main seal is worn. Calibrating the connector is extremely simple. First, actuate the connector onto your desired port. Once the connection has been made, hold the calibration button for two seconds to store the first point. From there, a 30 second timeout window starts where an optional second point can be set. I'll deactuate, apply pressure moving the piston further, and then hold the calibration button again for two seconds. The second point is now stored into the connector. The calibration tools teach functionality can also be accomplished using an output voltage from a PLC wired directly to the FE or FI connector. A gauge pin or machine tube can be used to set the second point or range. The calibration points are stored on internal memory so they are retained even if power is lost to the connector. The benefits of connection verification include the ability to verify connections are properly actuated prior to starting a leak test, eliminate waste caused by failed connections, collect data to verify operators have made the right connection, automatically start leak test after the connection has been made, improve safety throughout the testing process, and eliminate other expensive components that provide similar feedback. Contact FastTest to order a connection verification enabled FE or FI quick connector today. Be confident in your connection.